Um, has everybody had a chance to look over the minutes? And do we have any changes or additions? <laughs> okay, uh, can we get a motion to approve the minutes? I move we approve the minutes as written. Awesome. Agenda or minutes? Oh, no, we need to the agenda. Oh, yeah. oh I'm sorry, I'm jumping ahead of myself. Yeah. Okay, okay let's look at the agenda. Oh. Um, do we usually approve it? Yeah, I don't usually approve it. I mean, we, 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 we have, have we have, we, 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 we have, we did that when we changed up the you format. Yeah, okay. So, you should, because it's, um, that, it's, that allows folks to do yeah. something to move or something. To yeah, that's okay. Uh, My bad. Uh, I'm no, it's thinking fine. of Christmas here or something. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but let's, uh, anybody have any changes to the agenda? And move we approve the agenda. A second. I'll second that. Okay, all in favor? Aye. Aye. Okay, it has passed. And let's move right on to the minutes. Um, you want to take a minute to look at them, otherwise, if we won't make changes. Okay, may I have a motion to approve the minutes? I move we approve the minutes as written. All second. <laughs> We're doing good. Yeah, I'll all roll that along. We have to vote. Okay, all in favor? No. I'm fine. Okay, thank you. All right, does there any public here to be heard? No, those are not. And uh, let's talk about the packet updates. Anything to discuss there? I think they're I think it's just annual report, which is on the agenda, so we could, I guess, discuss that in order. Yeah, it's on the agenda anyway. Yeah. Okay. okay. Moving right along here, well, let's start with other business. And we have the SHF grant project. Any news on that? Complete. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, the window is in. So yeah, as of well, not yesterday, but or I'm sorry, not this week, but the previous yeah. Monday. Mm -hmm. So yeah, and they um, yeah. So all of that is complete. The news release is out and um, has been picked up by I think the leader and the Times Call and good. And uh, so they even said they saw it in the folder. Or the oh, daily camera. camera. Yeah. Wow. That's so great. we're having a little two hour open house tonight and next Wednesday. Um, just to kind of, because the news release, the, the full release didn't come out until after the holiday open house. So just to make people more time to see it if they weren't aware before. Um, so yeah, but everything is, is finalized with that in terms of the work being done. Um, so yeah, I don't know any other updates like from Carrie or anything then. That's okay. Yeah. So then in the future we can take this off. I think so. Yeah. Okay. Is there any last um, report or um, communication that goes to Mr. Carolina? Carrie's been taking care of all of that, so I'll just double check with her and make sure everything's completely wrapped. But yeah, she's been in touch um, with everyone. So yeah. Karen, what was your question? Is there any last communication or report that needs to go to Mr. Carolina? <coughs> Or the completion, the grants, the completion of the grant. Okay. Um, let's move on to donations and contributions. Any updates? I know that you have to go with your legal. It's with legal. Okay. So still there. That could be <laughs> several weeks or, yeah, so we'll hear back from that. But. So we will keep this for next time. Yeah. Okay. Um, the digitized scrapbook. Any news on that? Um, they, the museum has a new director of history, so we're going to be working directly with that person um, instead of with Eric Mason, so I've been connected with them, but since they just started, we're going to give them a little time to kind of, you know, get their feet wet, and then we're going to connect with the new year and look at things um, for basically the board to go over there and, and start scanning, um, but I think the plan is still, as we talked about, is just to start with the first one and kind of figure out how much of an undertaking it really is and then decide if we want to keep moving forward. And okay, what is the name so, of the new director of history? Um, Elizabeth. It's a possibility. Okay. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> <Okay. laughs> <Okay. laughs> You're doing good, you got the first name. Yeah. 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 Okay. So yeah, so we'll connect with them uh, in the new year. Great. Okay, um PEO Founders Day program. Any news on that? Where do you work on that? Karen? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, we're, we're, we're working on it. We will be working on that um, here pretty soon, but basically we already discussed what we're going to be doing there uh, at the last meeting. Will we have a meeting? We will have a meeting before that. Yeah, because it's the 20th. Oh, yeah, it is. And we'll present the program to you guys before, or basically, again, um, we're just going over the history of it. And, and uh, we thought we would use um, a computer and show some of the film. And do basically PowerPoint. PowerPoint. Yeah. PowerPoint tour. I don't think we're doing anything out there that they should be concerned about. And you're familiar with the layout of the facility? We have already seen the facility yeah, okay. and exactly how we're doing it and um, discussed that. And basically, we just have to put the presentation, finalize everything. But yeah, it should be. I even considered crossing it off again. Just <laughs> I want to see. <laughs> that would be great. And like historic. Yeah. yeah. I, I've yeah. got a hat and the whole shebang. It's just the yeah. dress. Right. That would be so cool. Yeah. Yeah. I think that. Awesome. You should yeah. do it. Yeah. Don't feel the pressure, but. Yeah. 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 No, no pressure. No pressure, no pressure. No pressure but yeah, come to that. I just got to get through the holidays first. That's why I'm running like I apologize. Yeah. All right. And uh, then we already had two of our open houses for the holidays, and I know we did really good. Did yes, turnout. yeah, we've got the the numbers here. Um, yeah, it was great turnout. So the Santa open house was two hundred and twenty five people total, awesome. um, kids, parents, families, etc. Um, and we got one hundred sixty seven dollars in donations. Thank you so much. Uh, and then the holiday open house, we had four hundred and eight people. Uh, over half of them came in the first hour. <laughs> so, uh, it was a little nuts, but it was great to see the house so full and everybody really enjoyed themselves. Yeah. Um, and then we got two hundred twenty-nine dollars in donations and one hundred twenty dollars in merch sales oh, that great. evening. Nice. Wow. So yeah, so five hundred sixteen dollars total brought in from those events, um, and six hundred thirty-three people visiting the house. That's wow. And thirty-eight new email signups. Thirty-eight email signups yeah. 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 for the, oh, the Callahan specific. That's a success. Yeah. 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 So yeah. yeah, great, great numbers from that, and everybody had a great time. And like I mentioned, small open houses tonight and next Wednesday as well. So yeah. Now, do you? Um, want anybody is it voluntary if you want people to show up or are you just gonna handle it if anybody wants to feel free um Jacqueline and I will be here and I mean as much as we'd like another 400 people in the house I'm hoping not that many <laughs> <laughs> show up, it's just two of us but um I know it did go out in uh, a lot of the papers local papers so what time, what time should we have the most it's from four to six tonight and also next Wednesday so if anybody wants to feel free but, but also so you're having obligated. additional open houses too Okay. Yeah, and the idea was that um, because the news releases, the full releases weren't out in time for the holiday open house, they thought that along with telling people what was going on, there should be an opportunity for people to come see the space that didn't make it to the open house. So we're offering those couple little extra segments of time. Um, so yeah, no obligations. It will we'll, we'll all be oh, okay. here for generally if it behaves themselves. Um, so thank you. <laughs> so, I just so, to so, say, when we left at 7 whatever, on last week, yeah. Cindy and I walked out the door together, and a car pulled up, and gals got out. And yeah. yeah, they had a thing that said it was open from four to eight. And yeah, she was and that so was for the chamber or the where did they get or long visit long inside long 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 inside long visit long visit long long visit long long visit long visit long which is yeah, and it made us feel so fun. She was so excited. Yeah, so I'm sure, and I wasn't really know realize what they were getting there. I am not sure, but actually I have a meeting um, just after a couple days after this night. Yeah, we'll have to make sure that from there to kind of connect to see how we can be more directly connected with the core. Yeah, but they're publishing stuff so, that we didn't give them. Yeah, I don't know where yeah. they have that. They shouldn't be doing that. Maybe a lot of these places will just repeat something they've had before. Right. Yeah, that's exactly it. They mm -hmm. just repeat it for hours. Like, just week. the hours from last year. Yeah, they did that with our something with them, one of our things. Okay. Yeah. Maybe so we could put a little spur like attention, new hours. Yeah, or something like that. Yeah. Or like they ask us before. So maybe she'll show up tonight. Yeah. 
That's nice. Hopefully. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 So, so we'll be more directly connected with his online and eventually the chamber moving forward. So that'll be good. Oh, good. But yeah. So. so yeah, we should know anybody who's going to advertise us. We should mm-hmm. know about it. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 So, quick question. So, you've got. Just to repeat, you've got the uh, open house tonight, and when's the next one? Next Wednesday. Wednesday. So just tonight and the following Wednesday from 4 to 6, just to give another opportunity for a holiday open house. I can't just help a quick little tonight, but I could help Okay, next Wednesday. Sure. Thank you. Yeah, and it's, like I said, no obligations. We didn't expect to have a full open house. Yeah. Well, I feel bad that I missed this this last one today. Oh. I just was not. That's okay. Everything yeah. went great. Yeah, so, yeah, we had a, we had a good well, trip, so. Good time. Yeah. yeah. So, okay. Um, the next on the list is the updated video, the information on the video. Okay. I do not have any updates. Okay. Hopefully, in the new year, we'll get that did, did it, underway. Did, did we figure out how we're going to do a, a. I can't even think today. The, the process. Yeah, the process. Yeah, same as what we've discussed. We need to get some bids and then. Um, those will be reviewed and then we'll go from there. So. And are you, are we going to see what our, we're bidding for first before you put it out or are you guys going to put that together? To review it before mm-hmm. it goes out? Yeah. 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 We, should, we should be able to do that. Yeah. And then, but, but we're looking for next year for sure. Yeah. Type of thing. Okay. Yeah. Absolutely. So, yeah. Okay. Um, moving on. <laughs> Um, we're going really quickly. This yeah, week. Um, who needs a little more coffee or something? <laughs> <laughs> a club affair. Let's talk about club affair. Um, I know we've got it on the schedule for what, September next year. Mm-hmm. Is there any, anything else? I don't really have any updates about that. I, after the last meeting, we talked about that I would look through old files and see if I could find any information, which I found an empty file that says club affair. <laughs> so that was not very helpful. That's so helpful. Yeah, so I have, to be honest, I have basically nothing for that. So I think, Candy, and probably the rest of you have a lot more information um, in terms of getting that started. So uh, I you wanted to... Just, uh, Connie Newman. Okay. Connie's got files on her computer. Oh, okay. She said she sent me. <laughs> Great. Okay. okay. So, yeah. And those um, letters you have are real good. Yeah. So yeah, we, we've got a place to start. So. Okay. <clears throat> so I guess... What we should be working on now is just names of clubs, and if you can get a contact person for those clubs, that'd be great. So things you belong to, or you know people belong to, <clears throat> reach out to them, and then you can send those to me or Brittany. Do you, do you have a list of past clubs that we've gotten? Could you share that? I think yeah. she did. You did. Um, it was in that's the she last packet, I think. Yeah. Last okay. month, the last packet. Yeah, yeah, I think you a, gave it to. You gave me a hard copy, and then I think I gave it. Let me see if I still have it. Okay. This was, yeah, just the letter. There was a cast around, right? So, yeah, I think she passed it around. No, we didn't get it. Everybody didn't get it. But we didn't get it. Yeah, yeah. But it has a lot of clubs on it. Yeah, I can't. Honestly, I'm running through my mind as as befuddled as I am, and I'm thinking, do I have one? I didn't No, it was just passed around. Okay, good. So, yeah. yeah. uh, so would you make it a point for everybody to look at? Can we get a copy? Sure. <laughs> that would be good because that can so yeah. yeah. be duplicated. Yeah, maybe. I don't know if we could get one out today, but if, but yeah, kind of make it a, so that by the next meeting you might have a few to add to it, like you know, just kind of give or cross off. Cross off. Right. may not even be yeah. So, so that's right. That would be helpful if we could. True. And now, did you want to form a committee or? I, mean, I thought we were, we were leaving it as a co-chair. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Taking a co-chair. 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 I think we decided everybody was a co-chair. Well, well it's, it's a project. That okay. Yeah, it really needs to. It has to have a everybody. Support. So you need Those time outside of the regular meetings to work on it. I guess is. I think we probably will be. Okay. So okay. We did. Yes. All right. We'll keep that in mind. And. That's not going to run into the problem where there's only three of us can meet. Is that the case? As long as, I mean, we're doing board business. Yeah, it's a committee work. We, as long as we um, stick with the guidelines that we talked about, which mm-hmm. is when we're meeting like that, <clears throat> that 
were working on that specific task yeah. mm -hmm. and not discussing other items that, we, that may be coming up. And we just have to be cautious of that. Mm -hmm. you know? Okay. And People are human, of course, but. <laughs> yeah, okay. <laughs> and a, and I, that's if, the clarification we got. Okay, great. And then if we can meet at the house, that's great. But if we can't, we can always meet at the library or someplace mm -hmm. else. Yeah, that we're sure. not sure. The library is great. Yeah, yeah, anywhere. But you okay. reach out and, you know. The house okay. is open and available. That's right. too. Yeah. Okay, great. So that'll be scheduled as needed then. Okay. okay. So, all right. Well, I think that's going to go on well. And the last thing in old business is our annual report that I did hand out a copy of rough draft of it. Mm -hmm. And last month it was, um, we looked at it. I think, Karen, you were here, right? So we waited. But if there's no additions or changes, we can go forward with this. I just don't know why we're not using um, the text on that. I think that that was really helpful and for purposes of reporting and looking back over several years, having that consistency is important. Mm -hmm. Yes. It's so much easier to put the report together, too. Yes. And, 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 and you, yes, you use the same kind of Yeah, template. just go back to the. And you put in the, the plugged in current already. years. Mm -hmm. Exactly. This pretty much follows the last ones. One from last year. Can we go ahead and use the same format? I mean, it's I easy think, because it's well, it is the same. Only the difference is the graph is in there. But you, you had a graph that you didn't have lines in it last year. Do you have your questions? No. All right. So you were showing, and and I know in part the reason we did this last year was. Did you have three years? Yeah, three years, but right. even prior three years, years when um, Candy's last report was filed, did show prior years. So we were trying to be consistent um, in last year's report with prior years, which is actually quite helpful for reporting purposes, having those um, just quick numbers of from two years prior and then the current year. So I think we need to incorporate that again. So you want okay? Well, we have that information. We can see yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, it's easy. easy. Yeah. That'd be easy to do. How far just back do we want to go? Just yeah. putting the reporting to her. Yeah. Yeah. Essentially, we have the, yeah. Essentially, we have the current year and the two years back. It's oh. always just easy to. So you're just wanting to incorporate two, years two past years mm -hmm. along with right. and the graph. Yeah. Yeah. All yeah. on the graph. Yeah. 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 It's just change the tables. It makes it more. Meaningful. It does. It does. You see, you, you see change from year to right. year. It's a good snapshot. Okay. And, 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 and because we don't have a city council liaison, yeah. this is it's important that they get to see those numbers. But they read so many reports and stuff. Right. They can't remember. They can't remember what happened last year. Last year's reports. No problem. Then we'll add two years, previous years, to this, which isn't a problem. Um, and that's just in a graph. Yeah, just the graph. That's the one thing we have to change. That's the graph. So that's pretty simple. I don't know. It's good. I know that we don't have um, maintenance in here, um, which I think is, again, another thing that has been in years prior. It is important to continue with. Is that so, separate from the it, it's grant work? It is it actually, is. yeah, and with reason. So, what would fall under that? As um, an example, and kind of repairs, um, the legacy, well, I mean, any, any other anything things that, that are, did happen this year that were that are outstanding. Um, in part, it's so that we can um, keep it on the radar to ensure that the maintenance happens, um, and also if it's something that is. Uh, Historic feature, particularly if we need to, um, if this if the city is not going to provide funds for that, then we need to be doing some another grant. Um, it documents. Yeah, so that it documents that we've had this on um, on the calendar. That this is something that's outstanding. It does need to be taken care of. So it'd be future made. So, well. Maybe. It's, yeah, it's what maybe. happened during the year yeah. that you did maintenance. Yeah. Well, she mentioned that. And that's right. Like, that well, that's been on our list forever. <laughs> yeah. So, I mean, do you want to do you want a list of future maintenance yeah. items or anything on what was maintained this year? That's good. But yeah. What year is, is that one that you're referring to? Like, when was the last one that 
This is sure. last year's report, okay. Okay. and it covered 2020 through 2022, but it does, yeah, it's an overview of recent years, just a quick paragraph there, the 2022 activities, and the 2022 events, kind of a breakdown of, of those events. Um, that's helpful, too, for grant writing. Um, and then the 2022 maintenance, you know, things that, um, that have been done or need to be done. Um, a combination the 2023 of both. goals. Yeah. yeah. From the next year's goals, and that does include so future maintenance could go under future goals. Um, I and I would recommend we, we stay consistent with the prior goals, say 2024 goals in this current, mm -hmm. so that it lists so it's specific, it's not just a there are there's there's future goals, like as what are we going to do within the next year, and then there's um long term future goals as in. What's going to need to happen in the garden over the next two to three years? Um, you see the difference? Yeah, so I'm not sure. Those is yeah. So, what are our goals for next year? Well, that's what's to be determined by this panel. Okay. But, okay. So, are you saying that this is incomplete at the moment? Mm -hmm. <clears throat> so, and you want what added? Um, where do we begin? Do, do we begin? We already addressed yeah. the fact that you, you were adding, you are going to the... Okay, so we were going to add the, the things to the to the table. The table. And right. And the ground. <coughs> so it, is, is, you want more clarification and more consistency, um, if I'm understanding you right. Is that... Yes, so so we need to add in um, events. I mean, if you're asking me specifically what I'm suggesting we add in, um, well, we, list we all need events. We need an um, well, you have 20 to open houses and an art walk. And yeah, 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 sure. Right. You I understand. understand that's a bold point. I want to specify or list um, the, like we did in last year's report. I don't think we need to. It's not the last year exactly. No, it's not. Right. not That's kind of why I condensed exactly. some of the things because it still covers everything. But I, you know, when I was going through it, I just thought future goals. You know, we'll just do that. Well, is this report your report or is it the goals report? No, I guess it's the um, challenge report. Well, I thought it was the president's report. It is. So, so if you're just saying that this is the way you want to write it because this is just going to be new. Well, I mean, I don't want to miss anything, but I, I'm not saying that we have to match exactly last year. And it's not I don't, I just, what I'm asking for is, is there anything missing from this? And I agree with you. I think we definitely should add the columns for the years on the, on the tables here. Um, but is there anything else missing? Um, you know, a goal is something you may not have done before. We have done the open houses and all these other things before, so in my mind, it's a given that that's something we're going to continue or a decision that the board will make in the future. I don't know that you need to reiterate that under your What's been goals. done or what's going to happen? The what? You mean the, the activities that have been done or what's going to happen? I'm just saying... I don't know that you need to list them again as future goals. Um, Things that are going to happen. I think so Karen, I'm just saying, sorry. I'm saying here, I think Karen's point is that when she's putting together um, information for grants or if she's collating historical information, it's much easier to do if it's in basically the same format from year to year. Yes. I, that's the only thing. And I just know having okay, done so the report last year. format. Okay. Yeah. It, it basically a format because doing it last year putting all three years together and going back and tearing my hair out trying to figure out I mean that's well and, yeah. and, and I didn't <laughs> I mean, think it was just the president's report because it, this is our president this is yes the cha chairperson is presenting it but this re it really is a, a board report to the to city council it's not and officially in our charter it is a board report it's a board report that the chairperson is supposed to do, but it it, it is a communication from the board. So that's why 
Karen, both Karen's were involved and I was involved in, in writing. I just didn't write it myself. It was a, a it was a combination factor of how we did this. If I, if I also think under future goals we should add um, what we're working on in, and that is our future goal is is to achieve the the club affair. We're hoping that it's going to happen, but I don't see club affair on here either. But is that the actual goal? It, it is a short term goal. It is a short term goal. Of what we would like to achieve in, in uh, uh, 2024. I mean, to me, that's that would be quite an achievement if we can get that together and, and do that. And yeah, it is a short term goal. And so I, I understand. Um, Doesn't that happen every year, though? Mm-mm. No, no. no. The long term. I'm, I'm just saying it's a grandiose goal. The house. goal is yeah. the goal is to get more clubs followed. Right. Correct. Mm-hmm. So yeah. instead of saying that's a club thing. affair. Yes, make it our overall goal, goal is, 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 is to goals. get solicit more clubs. More clubs. Okay. To have yeah. more club clubs affair and more right. the right. Because club yes. affair yeah. is more to help them get more members, right? Yeah. I mean, we charge them for a table. Yeah. Us for, so that kind of isn't the same as our goal of getting more clubs to come here and use our. It's, 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 it's more cheap too than, than just for, other, for those clubs to get members. It's 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 community support done by the county. No, I mean club affair itself is mainly for those clubs to rent a table from us and advertise their club to get more. It, it is. It serves many it, facets. It, it does that, but it also highlights what we do, mm-hmm. and it does our community outreach, which we need for grants. Mm-hmm. That's another reason why it needs to be stated because okay. we're doing it for grant purposes. So then we can say, look. We showed this to city council. They're aware of this is what we're going on, and we're still short on funds. We're going to write a grant. Could you please help us? Um, this helps in that mm-hmm. that we, we have a documentation of a, a report that was sent and presented, um, and the city is aware, but they do not have the funds for this. And we have asked. We've asked nicely for several years, but they said no. And that's what. Normally, when you're doing a grant, you need to prove that you passed. Yeah. Get your you also have to prove that. But you've got to have the documentation. But you're also proving how your organization is supporting the local community and beyond. So there's so, so, yeah, there's so many you know, complicated. And the best way I can explain this is it would take really sitting down and reading through the the application requirements <laughs> right. of, <laughs> of the grant. <laughs> and, and if you did that, then you'd remember maybe that this is part of yeah. that a component of that. So we really, for so many reasons, this report... Well, now we do have on here continue to preserve funding for preservation and restoration programs. So we're continuing to... Pre- so that is touched in here on the future goals. But how have you shown that you have supported or reached out? Well, is that necessary? It is. It is. It is. It's absolutely necessary. That's one of our things. We're, 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 we're not writing a grant here. No, but we will. Well, we, and we use we aren't writing a grant, but we have Please. to document it. Yeah. And have when you do, to use for the this grants. documentation supports it. So it's really for the good of everybody, in particular the grant writer, with this information be... Can I get with your help me? with that to write that section of it? Sure. Because you know the wording you want to use there, and you're better at it than I am. Well, <laughs> obviously. What do you mean? Yeah. So, so specifically, we're wanting to add a future goal. And does that cover what we've discussed? Mostly, yes. Mostly. I think if it's okay, we'll go ahead then and meet. I'll we can put together what I'm suggesting, and then we can present it back to the board in um, January. Well, actually, we need to get this pretty much done this year, so it'll have to be in December. Um, it, we actually didn't put give the board the, uh, the report until January, yes, so we could meet one more time and have it finally look at it mm-hmm. in at the January meeting. And should not be an issue. So that's what I mean. That's what I mean. Because we don't really have information first. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Yeah. Yeah. yeah. So really, it's a, it's a, I, I think the wording you can you can look and say, okay, I think we we got it in January, and then mm -hmm. we kind of had to remember we try to have those numbers right after. Well, it's, it's that's February. exactly it's it. Quick that's, as we can. But, that's why we we waited to do yeah, the numbers yeah, so they were accurate. Yeah, based on just when we get stuff from. So so I know you you are hopefully not planning a huge trip or anything, but but if you could. Possibly yeah, the January. Or, you know, traveling. Actually, places that are warm. Yeah, exactly. No, I'm just going to say, are you going to be in Hawaii or some place? Yeah, we could. Oh, definitely. <laughs> we should take us with her. <laughs> okay, so um, let's right. let's try to get it balanced enough that we can maybe complete it. It's not a big deal. Yeah. So yeah, add what's needed to be added. added. Yeah. So um, you want to add the video to future goals? Yeah. Um, yes, please. Yeah. Yeah. And that's part of the reason I know we had, you know, if we can't be at every it's meeting, okay. I, this is like two months I've had this right. board. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Um, do you, would it be helpful to, to if I put together a, a, like a more robust list of events for that section? Yeah, I'll just work on it. Okay, that's okay. Okay, then I can send that. Or yeah. I'll just, 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 just, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just, I'll just, of the report. Hmm. For a soft copy. Yeah. Okay. She's going to help write the outside of the packet. You just want the word document. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. It's a working document. Yeah. Yeah, we probably should kind of turn up the steam on it a little bit. So it done. So. Alrighty. Um, so that's still work. That's what needs work. <laughs> yeah. Okay. <Thanks. laughs> Um, new business. Um, looks like we have a few things here. Um, house inventory. Now, Marie, you kind of started this one, which is good. You made some good points last time. Um, uh, we don't know where to paint this. <laughs> we, we don't. Um, in the past, the board's always been responsible to help doing the inventory, and I think it's important that we continue to do so. Um, I know it's been kind of taken over by the staff. But I, I believe um, there are lists, and I think we as a board should know what's in the house and what we're doing. Because we've stopped doing that inventory, um, we don't know where everything is. And we have art pieces and other things that are missing and um, have been inquired about. And I think it's, at least from this starting point, the board should be aware of the inventory, and we should have the inventory list to look at every year. Besides, it's fun. You just got uh, things that yeah. you didn't know were <laughs> here. That's um, a really important part. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I found a list from last year. Okay. Um, yeah, and I would love help from the okay. board to do that. So I would say let's let's talk about that in, in January. Mm -hmm. Okay. It with the new board set and a date. set a date. Okay. Um, try to get, Perfect. And get if it's everybody, it's everybody. You know. But, it was in the past years prior to to other things um it's always been the full board that okay. came that makes and sense. got together and and did that and personally i know some people think it is a chore i think of it as a gift to recognize truly recognize what all we have in this house mm -hmm. and and then we can speak to it better personally that's just my point so january and that will be obviously computerized, so it's easier yeah. to maintain. Yeah, right. It is um, now, so I'll just yeah, okay. yeah. Check it off if it's still made way to Let's add it to out. the packet for January. The, to the what? The form. The, the, what's there? The to list the to the packet. Okay. Yeah. 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 Okay. Now will you be inventorying the shed? Or not the shed? Excuse me. The carriage house too. <laughs> there is a shed down there. Shed. So. <laughs> you know, you gotta be careful. Huh? <laughs> There's one oven. We know that. Yeah, we do know that. Maybe not for much longer. It doesn't belong there, but it's yeah. yeah. uh, yeah. yeah. um, What we did before was we took the list and it got divided up when we worked in It looks like it's pairs. set of room by room. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. did that so work one, well before? Yeah, it does. Okay. One question. You finished the room, you went on to help with another room or right. take another room or whatever. But. One question I have about the inventory is. Um, if it's something that was donated, is that indicated there, or is it That's a good idea. not necessary? Yes. Does it go in a different spot where we have our 
you know, donations uh, list. I think if it's in the house, it should be on the inventory. We can check yes. off if it's a donation, but I definitely think if it's in the house, then it's going to stay in, you know, it belongs here now. It should be on the inventory. I think the so, history of things coming and going being associated with the inventory list. Yeah, is a good okay. Plan moving forward is yeah. actually. Yeah. 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 It's the right place for it. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, because that's otherwise like the picture that is missing was yeah. a donation, but mm -hmm. it still should be inventory. Mm -hmm. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. So we're going to set the date in January, mm -hmm. not necessarily do it in January. Right. We might. But uh, we're January, 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 we'll we'll set a date. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, items from staff. Staff related. Um, I have some things unless you're off. Oven. You, you Oven, yes. Some, she's had some success. Well, let's, yeah. Right, well, uh, I failed. It's still in there, <laughs> but, <laughs> well, we'll see. It's still in there. We did have a movie company come out that did, I don't know, a diagnostics, we'll say, on it. And uh, <laughs> and, uh, and kind of did a little test run to see if they could remove a part that is causing it to not fit. Um, and they had... Part of the oven, yeah. Mm -hmm. um, and they had what they feel is success, and so I'm waiting for them to reach back out to set a time to try and move it. Wow. So I'm still saying try and move it, but they feel like they should be able to and move it. They'll take the old one. And they'll take the old one. one. Mm. Yes. Yeah. Wow. Yes. yes. What are they going to do with the old one? Uh, <laughs> no. 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 I don't know what they do with the old one, but I don't care. Yeah, scrap metal. Wow, that's <laughs> yeah. right. So, right. so it's very nice the meeting that there's. Then the question of will it connect and will it? Um, will it is there any concern about the new connecting? connecting? Yes. Not that I knew of. Um, I don't believe that's a concern. I think we oh, talked okay. about who was going to like if. Oh, yes. oh, oh I just like, can they or is it something like, else? Yeah, that's about. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just like, yeah. Just like, yeah. like who's gonna make but it work? Who's yeah. gonna make it work? Yeah. Well, <laughs> someone else will disconnect it and reconnect it, not the moving company. Yeah, well, I can feel it. Oh, so so I just had my floors redone and I had to move my big Viking and shift it, and that was, yeah. They called it the beast, so I can't yeah, the beast. Yeah. So the company that's going to take that did the diagnostics and <laughs> take apart <laughs> that's right, off yeah. of it is that a mo an oven company or a company. moving Johnson. company? Yeah, oh, and they're oh, kind of oh, going Johnson. above okay. and beyond for us to try to make this happen. Yeah, we do a lot He's made several trips Johnson, to, so nice. yeah. to yeah, went yeah. to the hardware yeah. store yeah. and got a tool and a bunch of so. It, yeah, I appreciate their efforts and, and hopefully it all will be yeah. some version. That's so, okay, we'll put it on our prayer yeah. list. <laughs> yeah. 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 yeah, and that's kind of part of a it? larger project of getting the house to make, is it? I mean, in order. Like I don't oh. you know. I think it's like a, yeah. an yeah. inch. Yeah. Like, yeah. take a piece of trim off the door? No. Because we've done that in all of wanted to. It's not. It goes beyond that. We'd rather, yeah. Yeah. Yes, yeah. I'll stand on um, it. I love the fact that there's a plan. That's, yeah. 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 Uh, they, they are experts. They would know how to do all of that. So that's right. wonderful that they are yeah. Yeah. on it. So I'm just and then hopefully, sure they like them. down the road, we can maybe think about different ways to store the tables and, and whatnot that are in there to just kind of get that space cleaned up. And we're working on cleaning up the, the upper floor and the basement of the auto house as well, just to create more viable storage and have things organized a little more. And so, yeah, it would be a good long term project. but. Yeah. That's future yeah. goals. Future yeah. goals. <laughs> Clean your yeah. house. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, um, that uh, also does. I just figured I would put this out there. Does anyone know where to get more of the books printed? The Callahan book. Um, we only have one copy left of the oh, large wow. print. Wow. Who did you use? Do you have not permission. done any digging on it? So there may be some information, but I just figured I'd ask if anybody knew mm -hmm. where those came from. No. Well, to start with, with that is to get Ron's from time, time. Which, which is no longer Ron's, but yeah, but um, they used to do a lot of city marketing. There's a, there's a copyright. It's inside the book, you can see it. Um, and it would take. And, uh, and the printing company 
to get permissions to print one of those. So the folks that Thank wrote you. it had it printed and we purchased from them? Yeah. We didn't purchase those. Okay. So they were, we gifted them to the house. Okay. So they paid for all of the printing. Wow. And so we sure it connect with yeah. them. Challenges Rosalind is not printing I mean, well. No, she's not. And she's not. Um, I don't know that our printing company's in business any longer. Okay. So we have legal. a little bit of a copyright concern. Yeah. Yeah. Legal. So, yeah. yeah. Okay. And so, so we, we can just get it right now. Right. Ask them what their advice is. Okay. Yeah. And, and reach out to legal Jared, instead Jared. of reaching out to the. Start with the legal. Okay. Because the copyright is. Those are our guys, and it's easy to get hold of. Okay. At least with the new Jeremy. Yeah. Okay. And, and I talked with Rosalind a few years ago. Um, she had asked her if she had any of her materials and she'd be willing to um, provide or share those with us. And she said she apologized, but that she lost all of the, their materials in the flood. Um, yeah. Okay. And um, I asked her if she'd be willing to allow us to copy the books and at the time she said i'm not comfortable with that that was my gift that was my amy's gift to the house mm -hmm. and so at this time I'm okay so it was given to us and we can sell them but we can't recopy them right so, so what would our other option be is to create our own book I mean, we really should have something. If we're going to have a book that needs to be replenished, mm -hmm. we should have so it set up. Let's get, yeah. let's and get that our, would be in terms of copying the existing. Well, just just say, yeah. here's what we're looking at. Here's what we want to do. Let's let them look at the legal, legal ramifications so that, so that we understand from our end kind of what we're looking at so we can go back to them, hopefully, um, depending on health and other circumstances. And it, at least we understand our footing on that. Okay. I mean, I'm sure they don't want us to not be successful with it, I'm sure, but right. at the same time, they did the work. I get it. Yeah. Get it. So, that's, that's so let's understand. And, and right. let's understand. I'll, yeah. I, I'll be very clear. She's in a nursing home in Denver, in Denver and her nephew is handling her affairs. So I don't know how cognitively or she has. Okay. Okay. Well, yeah, legal. Well, if she, if she has a uh, power of attorney, power of attorney going, then that would be the person. Right. Yeah. That might be the nephew. Mm -hmm. yeah. But again, we're, both those things we're getting into the legal areas. And so we'll mm -hmm. start with our. Okay. Mm -hmm. That'll be interesting to see what legal says. Yeah. Just make sure we're doing the right thing. Okay. Definitely don't want to step on. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know no. if this is relevant or not, but you know, the used bookstores in town get things like that. And I don't know if we could put our names in and say, call us if you get this mm -hmm. book in. Yeah. Yeah. Whether we resell them or not, I don't know, but it would <laughs> maybe get us more copies. Yeah. Yeah. But I think going forward, we should have something we can mm -hmm. replenish as needed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. We so we have. should, you know, somebody donated, we want to buy out the copyright yeah. data eventually. And, yeah. Yeah. So yeah. One, create a new one book. question right. I have, you know, has something to do with if we're producing another one in the future is, was the content developed by Rosalind or that she just printed it, printed it and paid for the printing? All no. of the research, all of the content, oh, the travel yeah. to, um, she wrote to it. even oh, do the research. Okay, that, that's um, big. Yeah, but they did all the work. Wow. Okay. So yeah. that's why this is I get it. kind of sensitive. That's, yeah. They did all of that work. Okay. It's a work of yeah. Well, thank you for that background information. That helps me. It's hard to me. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um, That'll be interesting to see where that goes. Yeah. I'm yeah. Curious myself. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Um, last thing I have, we talked about this a little bit at the last meeting. Uh, I did get the measurements from this. I don't know if you saw this one, Karen, but mm -hmm. um, I well, yeah, read about the it, measurements see. from. So it does fit very nicely in that spot. I don't know. What about the height? Where yeah, height. It, it's, it's not going to go out. Did you? No, there's, there's yeah, a few inches yeah. below the frame. Did you see it, Karen? Um, so I don't know if we're interested in it or not. It does fit. That was the kind of the question oh. that we had lingering. 
Um, the other question that uh, the person that's willing to donate, I guess it's, it's, I'd said before, it's Jacqueline's mother's. Um, they're wondering, because the other question that we had is if it can be tuned. And so they're wondering if that's something that we would pay to find out or they would pay to find out. I assume that they would need to pay to find that out. But that was if you the last question. Do you know if it's... I, I guess sort of start looking at how much. How much that would cost. It's, okay. it's not. <laughs> because it's, it's yeah. only when yeah. it's tuned you have to find out if it's tuned. Right? <laughs> well, you don't even right. know yet. Yeah, yeah we'll they have out. to pay for that we'll service. Yeah. Yeah. Find out mm -hmm. if it can be tuned. Yeah. As opposed things. to tuning, so hopefully, it's it's if it can't be tuned, maybe you have to pay yeah. a couple hundred dollars to find out. I if wish, it yeah, I wish yeah. Chris Fingers and my wife was still open because that's who yeah. I would have gotten to. But now depending on the cost, we might be willing might to pay cover to see the, if, it, if it can be tuned. Question. Okay. And can I, I ask what year that it. piano is from? Um, it's circa 1900. Okay, so it's the right time. But yeah, it's Smith and Wax Victorian upright. Yes, so it's certainly a period yeah. appropriate. Sure, um, I don't know about, this is all I've seen of it, so I don't know like how immaculate or not. It's in good condition. I don't know if it's in immaculate we have condition. you <clears> or <throat> maybe a team from here actually take a look at it? Physically? I think that would be Do that first important. before we put any money into it? Just yeah. Kind of make a trip. And how far away is it? I mean, where is no, it? No, it's in Broomfield. That's too far. But where is it? Broomfield. I would say maybe we could, a couple people want to volunteer to take a look at it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Before we make a decision. Mm -hmm. I like that idea. Yeah. Um, I, I would imagine there would be uh, a tendency to want to help, I mean, to accept something from someone on our staff because it would be nicer right. to do that. The only thing I'm wondering is it would be less expense and less um, uncertainty if you look for a piano that they they claim it has been tuned and it's you know it's tunable and they have tuned it. So then you don't pay for that. You don't have the question. This, and it's also free. Most does of anybody the time. here play the well, piano? Because, oh, you know, if we did send some people to look at it and see, you know, run a few chords on it and see what it sounds like, yeah, you can yeah. kind of, you can kind of tell. tell for it. Yeah. And I think like you know, <laughs> if we, like we had talked about in the last meeting, if we want to hold out for one that's perfect, if that's possible, I don't know if that's mm -hmm. possible to find, but, you know, I, I think still yeah. keeping yeah. looking while we're debating mm -hmm. this one is a good idea. And well, I've maybe seen it's not some the right that one. Were, <clears throat> possibilities. I just haven't brought oh, it up because so I figured we had so many other things going on. Mm -hmm. But I do see some that are in great shape and they've been tuned. Mm -hmm. I think that's great. And they're free. I think that's that's great. Free well, what we have to shape. pay to move on. Right. Which would be the same as this one. Yeah. 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 That's that's free. Free. I mean, it would be so nice to accept something from the Jacqueline family. Yeah. But if you're thinking, you know, how much do we still have to do, and is it still going to be, is it going to be a good piano that you can play? Yeah, yeah. I think, I think it, is. it might be a great opportunity, but we shouldn't feel pressured yeah. to take it just because yeah. of yeah. the connection. Right, right, right. But it doesn't have to be concert quality. You know, I mean, in other words, no, this one just so it's it would, yeah. honestly, I disagree. I I think it should be at least playable and well playable but i meant it, no great but playable. so if we have somebody that wants to do recitals, recitals we can do that yeah. and that's why mm -hmm. it can't just be marginal it, it's one of those things we mm -hmm. paid or, or um questers paid to get the piano upstairs and in good condition so that a uh, concert pianist could play on it it is an instrument and I just think that we we try to get the best type of instrument here. Why don't you get a piano? Yeah, yeah. 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 I don't yeah. want to forget it. Yeah. 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 It should be the it's right one. Exactly. And maybe this is, or maybe this isn't. It's got but some things in it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I said we should look at it. Oh, yes. Other question I was agree. the bench. It does not have the original bench. There is a oh. bench, but it's not the original bench. So that was the other question. And is there a bench that has it? Is it period or is it a box? I'm not totally oh, sure. Oh, it's no. slightly pictured there, but you want to so let's say we oh, need a team to go get it. Okay, I think we we can talk about that in January, but we need okay. before we make any really moves. I think yeah, yeah. Can we postpone this to January? Um, 
I guess my head's swimming at the moment. I can't. I just can't. Get a couple but, of people. Um, did they have a timeline? Uh, I, so I felt like last time it was. Yeah, we just did. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I think it's as soon as possible because um, they're looking to, they're needing to have it moved. But I'll ask about a time for people do, to go see it. Do let me let me ask you guys this in the interest of some expedience. Um, it sounds like maybe you two you you've been seeing pianos you played maybe the two of you would go with Brittany and mm -hmm. take a look is that any yeah. thoughts on that sure. anybody that else works for me sure yeah. and if we don't need to maybe wait for the meeting but obviously post holidays so maybe you could set something up with these guys just contact okay. the two of them after the first of the year and just plan a field trip and you can you, know, you can take a seat yeah, that sounds good to me. But I, I, as long as we're in agreement that we're not just going to put a piano here, we're going to no. look for all a quality. Yeah. And we, yeah. We, yeah. That's, that's, any... that's our that's our yeah. expectation. Also, no yeah. Yeah. yeah, we're not very right. pressed to put nope. something in here. So no. will they be right? They, yep. they look at it and say, yeah, we no, know. I think. You know, but they she, just want to know. She knew we were looking for that. one, and they, they have one, one that they yeah. get to. Yeah, it's, it looks yeah. beautiful. And so it's yeah, it's, it's certainly period appropriate, and yeah. so yeah, you know, it might it might be an opportunity, or, and or we might want to keep looking. Yeah. Learning, you look into the tuner possibly. Okay. You know, is it tuner? Yeah. Okay. So first we'll send some people down there just to visually, and then if we're interested, and then if you're interested, we'll look into the tuner. Okay. Okay. So take a plan. Just one. Okay. Yeah. I'll remember that. Uh, that right. was all I had for staff items in this. Mm -hmm. Okay. Anything else? Okay. What about the board? Any anybody have any interesting uh, information or tidbits to bring? I thought it was interesting. Um, did uh, Connie Newman sent us an email about um, and a congratulation about um, our art and the time spot. She just wanted to reach out to the whole board. And she doesn't have everybody's addresses. So um certain ones we got we got it. You saw that email. Karen, did you see the email? Mm -hmm. um, yeah. She also brought us the the snippet of the actual not yeah, the was nice. full article, but the one that was just advertising the open house. She brought that to the open house for right. our scrapbooks, which yeah. I have, yeah. which is nice. nice. I thought I just wanted to state that it was very kind and thoughtful yeah. that she did mm -hmm. that. And yeah. it's nice to have a uh, passport members that are still reaching out and doing yeah. stuff. So. Mm -hmm. She also helped me in the music room when people were asking some she questions I didn't know. <laughs> sure. Yeah, yeah that's a lot of she information. Knew. Yeah, that's, yeah. Nice. She that's nice. Didn't have a lot of that she is a, She's a, a great um, asset. I told her yeah. we had another opening coming. Yeah, would you come back? <laughs> yeah. yes. I think she's uh, maybe maybe in the future. She's maybe yeah. she's yeah. still living with her mother. Exactly. She has her yeah, she has so to she goes to Texas. Like Texas. Like Texas. Yeah. Oh yeah. yeah. Um, yeah. Speaking yeah. of a newspaper article, I looked around. It's it's hard to get hard copies of that unless you're a subscriber. They did send us like a digital version of the full article, but if anybody has a chance to get a hard copy for the scrapbooks, uh, but otherwise oh. we, can, we can print it. Yeah, you can oh, print it my neighbor. Copy, she gets, does anyone else get the paper? So I get digital. Yeah, I get digital. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, so we've got the digital copy, but if anybody comes across it, it's the hard copy. Oh. And if he it depends on it, Tom. Recycle <laughs> it. <laughs> I will try yeah. that. Yeah. You yeah, something went out today. Would that be okay? That's possible. Okay, so we've got one. Then. Would have thrown it out. So. Yeah. I think your father might be a little bit hopefully slower in getting it to the recycling bin. She's been driving me nuts. I shouldn't say that. It's being recorded. But um, hopefully he hasn't recycled it yet. But I will do my best to get another copy. One other thing in February, I just in talking about that newspaper article. We're having a big Valentine's. Yeah, yes. that's the city putting that on, right? Or is that a problem? No, it's me. Well, it's it a little interesting. <laughs> I wasn't sure. It looked very interesting. <laughs> yeah. Um, um, and actually, I have a constant contact about ready to go, probably going out today, to the Callahan group. But it's it was in the brochure, and it's been advertised, yeah, it's been advertised by the city, but we'll have a uh, Callahan and do, going out. Do, do you need volunteers for that? Sure. 
<laughs> yeah, we would probably. I would. I would take help if you're interested. So, so, and it's the first year. So, this is our first community program of 2024. So, mm -hmm. bit of a trial run, but we right. hope yeah. it will be successful. Mm -hmm. um, and the idea. So, I've been reached. I've reached out to a couple of bakeries. The idea is hopefully we can get the food donated or heavily discounted so that our, um, you know. Profit sort of fundraising <laughs> margin on the event is much better. Um, you know, so that's that the idea. Be. And in exchange for like preferred vendor status um, oh. and advertise oh. and at the event. And mm -hmm. Will it be so upstairs so. where there's the big room? Or um, no, so it's it's afternoon tea, which will be here, and then upstairs will be the Victorian Columbus okay, so Valentine so craft. So it'll be like down here for tea, <laughs> up there to go work on. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, so and the like idea it. is like to kick off 2024 to have some more opportunities, you know, hopefully a handful of opportunities throughout the year for the for the public to come in for mm -hmm. ticketed, probably mostly ticketed events, but experience Calhoun House mm -hmm. in a different way that they mm -hmm. haven't in the past. Oh, you know, that's nice. uh, as opposed that's to just coming to a wedding or an open house. Can, like, can I say go to a fun event? Amazing. That's fabulous. Well, thanks. Yes. Well, wow. See yeah. how it goes. But yeah. very <laughs> so exciting. Exciting. we've sold a few tickets. So oh, that's cool. a good question. Are you getting a response? Oh. Yeah, we've sold a few tickets, and I think it you know just got advertised. So I think we'll, mm -hmm. hopefully there's only 36 seats, so it's a big, small event, mm -hmm. and hopefully it'll sell out. And hopefully so. you get as many people. Yeah. Yeah, we had some folks at the open house that were like, do you ever do teas? And I was like, well. Yeah, um, and then they signed up. <laughs> yeah, and yeah. then they signed up for the newsletter, which then they'll get the information and hopefully they'll purchase So it's it. February. Are you going to advertise it pretty heavily now and in January? So? Yeah, there's. so it's been advertised. Some, yeah, I, saw, I saw the first one. Yeah, we'll send out yeah. another one to our list to say, because tickets are now available as of yeah. like a week yeah. or so ago. Um, so yeah. <laughs> So, and then we'll advertise it more, of course, getting closer to Valentine's Day. Right. I think the, the date is February 11th, so it's just before Valentine's Day. Have you read about the waffle breakfast? No. Are we There's a picture upstairs. <laughs> she used oh. to do waffle past breakfast okay. out in the gardens, and we've done two, I believe. Okay. And then we've switched to ice cream socials. Oh, but yeah. The waffle breakfast mm -hmm. out in the gardens was... Really hit. Cool. Okay. Wow. When did so, that? When in the year did that usually take place? Um, so, summer. It would have to be more. Yeah. 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 It's when it has snow. But it's it was like, what I was thinking. It's like, how did this all turn on? Yeah. Put a candle on the table and you're like, warm it up. That would be great idea. Make sure waffle is really special. It's really in a hurry. Yeah, if anybody has ideas, um, you know, I think I'd like to do like a, a gardening seminar uh, oh, in the spring nice. out in the garden. Um, and then for October, I think there's a lot of, we want to do like a murder mystery dinner. Oh, those are oh, cool. oh yeah, that so and, nice. You know, somebody come in and do like tarot readings and calm. I mean, just kind of fun, fun opportunities for people to engage and feel Maybe we do like tea with Alice Callahan and we get the legendary ladies to come out. And, oh, that would be amazing. Oh, yeah. And that was one of, one of the things that I had hoped to do that we could um, have set the legendary ladies on a task and they like to do this to go and do all the research and then become the character. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I, yeah just That's that really fun. fun. Yeah. yeah. Do you really have fun. any ideas? Don't be shy. Okay. So, so, have you and Elise? And do you want some talking? Yes, actually, <laughs> she came, yes we have. She came to the open house and we finally met face to face. Uh -huh. um, and I'm gonna. She said excited to take it for me, which is very nice to go to their open house uh, tomorrow. Mm -hmm. So and then we're gonna connect with her and um, Llewellyn, who is or Luella, I think, who Llewellyn. is the uh, director of Hover Home. And then Beautiful. We'll, we'll That's great. Go from there and see what we can put together for cool. the chamber yes. and just kind of. Wonderful. Nice. Ownership moving forward. So. Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. Merging my two special things. Yes, yes. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> She's yeah. worked a lot at home. Yeah. It's yeah. just, you know, you only did it to make her happy, right? Yeah, right. right. <laughs> <laughs> it's, this this is that for the purpose? This is her holiday gift. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So, another item from the board is. Um, the communication that goes out in the Long Lot Magazine. I don't know if any of you saw this. I don't even have that anymore. Yeah. 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 Ye
Yeah, I that see comes that. from the movie. I mean, I got that, that but I didn't pull in with that. Yeah, it's a mail too. I got it. I don't know that. Yeah. Yeah. But yes, it gets mailed to you. Oh, okay. I get a recreation one, but I don't get it. I can get that. No. Mm -hmm. New stamp from my groceries. But anyway, um, it includes a, a calendar of things to do in November and December. Um, local things. And we are? well, no, we are not on it. But and that is my point. Um, because <laughs> they, you know, obviously they've got um, the Longmont Gift of Home Tour um, that, that um, the proceeds um, benefit the Habitat for Humanity. Um, they've got the, the Holiday Show, the Longmont Museum's Holiday Show. They've got um, so many things listed. The Gentleman Cooper, they've got. Uh, the all holiday open house at this uh, the Hover Senior Living. We've got so totally long long lights. lights. This house. Where does that come from? I think I give this to you so you can <laughs> have that in Where is that? I, I have not seen that magazine. Yeah, it's right. a Times Call. Oh, oh, wait. Wait. Oh, it is the Times Call. Is it? Oh. Well, we subscribe to that Times Call. Yeah, right? okay. there. Yeah. And that's yeah. what they yeah. charge extra if you subscribe to the paper. Oh, I don't get paid. And or yes, I do. I pay extra, extra to have. Yes, you do. No, I don't even yeah. subscribe to but, the paper, um, but I got one. But it mail. actually gets mailed to you. Yes. It Did it just come? Maybe it'll come to you. No. No. <laughs> no. It came earlier. Uh, it's because it's for November December. and December. Well, you probably but my paper point is, spot. Maybe you didn't have a contact. So I, don't, first. I don't know, but the museum is in here. And they even have like a spotlight, nonprofit spotlight. A glimpse into Longmont's past, present, and future. Oh, so, wow, oh, the museum. Wow. They should have reached out to us. Our, for the our next historic property. Oh, yes. We get those opportunities. We don't know. So my point is, this is one other opportunity yeah. that has mm -hmm. missed. And the Longmont Museum's in there. See, they got it. And the holiday lights are yours about part time. I'm sure that for the editor so should be slightly. Well, I would not say that, but I think there's opportunity that we need to bridge our communication lines. It's just another little plug for you. Yeah. And so, so. Well, this is a huge opportunity for next year, Judge yeah. Mel. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I bet their so, deadline's like right. June. Yeah. Oh, yeah. How often does it come out? Uh, no, it's uh oh. How frequently do yeah. they publish them? Mm, that's a good question. Uh, it's it's I think it's, it's, right? it's at least quarterly mm -hmm. and uh, every couple of months. Okay, let's so, see if it's but, something um, about they have itself. special oh, things that they and you didn't see us at all in there. No, here. The editors, Greg and I think again, it's just more of a matter of let's make sure our communication. Okay, so this is November, us. December, so it must be yeah, oh, Karen, okay. something we didn't know about is not seamless. We just didn't know about it. Exactly. So now we do, and that's it's a great opportunity. But, uh, uh, what I'm saying is our communication with time to call needs to be more seamless. So that well, and that's really it. I wish that wasn't too much. Well now I have that connection. But, yeah. Yeah. No. <laughs> and then there's a longmontmagazine.com that says read more stories at Longmont Magazine. Well the other thing is a, I'm not worried about is that there's not many people who put it in there. Right, exactly. Yeah, yeah. None of us yeah. doubt yeah. it. This would be so that you have. Okay, thanks to it. But then, um, and another sort of separate note, um, Something that I like that the museum does is they have a Friends of the Longmont Museum um, where they ask you to donate and then you donate whatever your amount is and you are considered a friend of the museum. I'm wondering if we can begin to do sort of type of thing for Friends of the Callahan House. Something similar to fundraiser mm -hmm. that's kind of an ongoing thing. We've city. tossed that around in the past yes. years ago. It is city property, city property. So we're, you know, um, we're not outside the scope of what the city is allowed to or does do. Donate or funds or donate items um, to. You know so what? We're going to have to double check. In with, mm -hmm. and, and there's there's friends in the library. There's friends at senior right. services. There are friends at the museum. Right. They they can operate different ways in different places. Um, they're, they don't operate like boards because they're not, they're not, they're city affiliated, but they're not, the responsibilities are different. Mm -hmm. um, that particular one operates as a foundation. 
because they're there there's a lot of numbers involved right. in that. But if it's something this group is interested in getting involved with, we can look at that for sure. I wouldn't I wouldn't stop us from looking at such a thing. So if there's I don't know, a division within the city that is friends and they have their different... It's not within the city. Okay. It's, it's, it's... They work, and I don't know a lot about them because um, recreation doesn't have friends. They're called members of the recreation. Yeah, they they pass holders. They pass holders. They're guests that pay the daily entrance fee. Yeah, you have lots of friends. They're definitely, um, it's something that's commonly done. So if you want to look at that, then I'll Hmm. get you in touch and you can look at probably with, I think a better version of it might be senior services. That's a, that or the library yeah. have a lot of money. I think just because the museum, the museum, yeah, they have a lot of money too. But but they they didn't probably didn't start with a lot of money. I'm say that. Right. The museum is is different because of how it got going and the folks involved and the stewards and yes. how it, it's large amounts of money which really operates as a foundation, um, which is becomes a whole kind of different setting financially. And if you did something like that. How do you distinguish someone who just donates online from someone who is a friend? I mean, is that two different channels of donation? Yes, probably. Probably. The difference between one kind of donation and being sort of a supporting member. Oh, I I see. If I remember right, I think you can, for a Friends of the Museum, I think if you you pay like an annual membership, you know, thing, it's like, $35 $35 or something, so mm-hmm. very minimal, oh. um, then you are considered a friend of the museum. Oh, okay. So that's the level that I'm freaking about. Right. So it's high yeah. 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 high level. But it is farther than just go in into the... It's just a You donate, you're a friend of the museum for that year. If you don't need it the following year, you're oh. friends of the museum. But there's, 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 there's a board yeah. associated with it too, mm-hmm. which is not this. Right. Board. So. Right. Oh wow. But so it's, it's a, a different. different. It's a, it's so there's a, a board for friends, yes. and, and then there's a regular museum uh-huh. board. Uh, do they get cool. like discounted museum entry? Like do mm-hmm. we get like a discounted entry? Or you can go into the museum anytime. Right. But the events you have to get full access. What would we offer? So Brian Aller is the board president of the museum. Just go yes. straight yes. into the Callahan Teacher. House Fund. That would be the yeah. point. No. And again, remember they, the Callahan House Fund is intended to maintain the historic integrity of Friends funds sit in different because the, they because yes. that board is completely they have the power over those dollars. Well, right. I guess I'm looking at it different. Um, it's a two-edged sword, I might add. Yeah, uh, I, I'm gonna say that I'm gonna look at it differently. Is in the same, you could be a friend of the Callahan House and come to a special event, and if you donated, we have a special event for them. I don't think we create a separate board that just handles that. We just acknowledge right. what you're saying, right? But as special but what you're donors, talking, this is a board. This is, is a whole thing. Mm-hmm. Both ways, Different. I think we could do. It's not neither one is out of the realm of being able to do. It's just I don't, I don't know. We don't. Like I said, well, I, I I think it's the listing of it. Personally, mm-hmm. I wouldn't think of it as a separate board. I would look at it as a thank you, and we have a special event for them. See, you get this lovely thing in the mail, you get to hold it, you get to feel it, and you say, oh, look at this, and look at that, and they're doing this, and they get, I get this because I donate it to $20 or $25 or what a nominal amount to, for the upkeep of the house, and then they get that request every year at a certain time. Is that what 
kind of what you're thinking? That's, mm -hmm. that's an example that I'm thinking we could incorporate. It's just a or five percent discount on your event, or ten yeah. percent, whatever. Something, but yeah. But but are and I'm asking Karen you specifically. Are you so like I said, there are kind of two different sorts of angles that we're looking at. Are you thinking what Maureen's talking about, or are you thinking a friends group that would that would be a separate supporter outside of this board that, that would be its own its own thing, a la what they have, what senior services has, what the library has. I think this board is perfectly capable of managing, handling okay. what so let's let's this would be for the purpose of that's essentially class. a fundraising angle. It's campaign. It's like not going in the same thing. But but utilizing but utilizing some of these yeah, we can call yeah. it. But but, yeah. but it is an ongoing thing and it mm -hmm. is um it's it's something that can change from year to year sure. and grow and it develops into something much larger than Denver, then that can be addressed yeah. as far as managing that. But um, it is just another opportunity for outreach to the community to um, remind them about who, what the Callahan House is, why it is here, and how supporting the can Callahan can House support our, uh, supports our community and not. Yeah, um, I think the fact that this <coughs> highlights so. And it's personalized, yeah. dear Karen. Yeah. And we can do that. To me, it's like, okay, I'm going to set this aside and I'm going to donate to this and PBS and whatever else. And now I'm going to add the Callahan House over here. This is having this piece of paper is is a great thing. And we can ask, would you like to be a friend of, friend of the Callahan House? I wouldn't use friend just because it's a separate thing. Well, it doesn't, it doesn't but have to be. I, so I, don't like, it let, but let us, I would say, let us go back. Um, I think the three of us need to check with a um, museum on this, which is easy peasy. Um, um, maybe we need to brainstorm a different language then. If you don't yeah, think well, let's use yeah. the term. So let, let, let us find, find out. Yeah. Supporter. Um, or the Longmont Community Foundation has partners, and Seagate, we yes. are always a partner. Mm -hmm. right? yes. Although partner sounds a little formal, formal for yeah. Yeah. this house. We, yeah, but we, we can, but we can tweak that. Yeah. Yeah. Longmont yeah. Community Foundation. At least as well. And so they, they, they have, have supporters for the St. Brandon Historical mm -hmm. Society, too. Okay. Yeah. And she sends a newsletter probably four times a year. Mm -hmm. So that would be your tangible. Yes, yeah, which is being addressed to a specific yeah. person. Yeah. Um, but you might know, ask her how that how that goes. And they've got like families, single, senior, different categories. Yeah. Now, do they mail a newsletter? Or is it electronic? They mail it. It would help to be electronic. Yeah, it would be cheaper. It would, it would be way less yeah. money. Yeah, yeah. Have to do electronic. You version. could make it look just like a paper. You know, make it look colored. I have a question. Do we see these funds going into the Callahan House? Yes. That would be the purpose. Yes. That's what that's what it is. All fundraising would go, would go into the Callahan, Callahan House fund. House fund. Yeah. And that's for the purpose of yeah. maintaining. That's well, maybe the, the so friends, so and if that, there is some kind of answer. communication with them at the end of the year, something, some offshoot of the annual report, not all the specifics, but something that would tell them this is what we accomplished this year, you know? Since you helped us, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now, are we considered a nonprofit? We no. Are. So they, there's no tax city. deduction. Okay, mm -hmm. so they, they can't use it as a tax. Well, well, you have to be a nonprofit. We're not a tax. We're not a five hundred one. Yeah. The city. We're not a five hundred one. Yeah. The people are making donations. The city. Is, the city probably is not a nonprofit. Right. But, right. but the city doesn't deal with taxes. We don't. We don't charge ourselves tax. We don't collect tax. We don't pay tax. Mm -hmm. um, there are times when we do um, grants or even they, they've kind of changed this now but when we I think this this year but like the alcohol permits because we didn't have we weren't a nonprofit we couldn't even go get our own alcohol permit we had to go right with the city Lama, Lama visitors association to do that so um, but yeah it's not not a nonprofit um, and sometimes we have to partner with, with nonprofits but 
We, we can certainly accept donation. We do it now. Or we can accept them, but I'm wondering if the people will ask the question, can I deduct this on an income tax? That's they what you're asking. That, 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 yes, yeah. actually you can. That I don't know that's whether it's the answer. Thought about that that when that when we were, people uh, are uh, a lot of students to not read it every day. Pretty sure they should. Yes. About that. It's I think it's just something you can talk to your tax advisor. Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah. Right. Okay. That's, that's, that's the right way to go. Yeah, because I keep cutting that away. This is probably more and more that gets Talk to your person. Yeah. It's okay. Okay. We can because it's hard to become a nonprofit. I mean, you have to go to jump. I don't think that we would be eligible. That would be the that would be the friends. That would be the friends. Like that well, would be the friends. I know. Oh, yeah, I I really want that's one of the help. I, I know how to do that. And I started a nonprofit. It's the recovery cafe, and so I know how to. If we ever want to do, do I'm saying we have to do a five hundred one c two. Yeah, I did a five hundred one c two application. Well, there right. it's kind of a but draw yes. for people to say, "Oh, this is a tax deduction." And then yes, more than right. one to get. But we can, yeah. but we can tell them what they donate to the Callahan House is they tax deductible. But they need to speak with their tax advisor. We yes. have a little form that we give them. Yes, yes. No goods or services were you know exchanged for this um, monetary donation. Okay. I didn't think, unless it was a declared a nonprofit, I didn't think it would be tax deductible. But I don't know taxes that well, so. Okay. I think. Talk to your tax advisor. I don't know. It's turbo tax. It's turbo tax. We'll we'll look into this. Yeah. Okay. I think it's a it's an interesting idea. Yeah. All right. Very good. Let's see, where are we? That was from the Board of Future Agenda Items. We have uh, e-blast content. Is there anything? Yeah, that's just remained here um, as an open invitation if anybody wants to put together historical content or tidbits about the house to share uh, on the Calhoun specific contact. And so that's always open. We mentioned leaving it on here. I don't know if we want to continue to leave that on here. I think it's going okay. the year, but. I think it's okay because it is, like I said, I don't I think a lot of times we'll be so in the middle of something, we'll forget to be thinking and looking ahead. And I think that it's helpful um, to have a reminder to think ahead. Is there something yeah. that we need to communicate to? Um, well, public? or is there something we'd like to get out there that's sort of special? Yeah. Um, so we're always thinking, so you know, I'm going to be taking care of events and things like that coming yeah. yeah, up. But if anybody wants to, you know. But I think it's Submit interesting. content. Well, yeah, well, so you're talking about historical information, whatever. Tidbits. Candace just brought up the waffle thing. That was something I had no idea. I don't have a memory or, or association with that. That's one of those little Did you know that we used to do this? Did you know? I mean, to me, that's interesting. Too, and if, so a, if it new happened today. long enough ago, maybe there's a photo that really looks kind of vintage -y. Oh, yeah, there is. Go with it. There's a lot yeah. of breakfast. My husband's I, grandmother, great grandmother. Oh, so wouldn't that, that be a great thing to? to but see, to, to me, us. that's an interesting tidbit. But you know what else? When we do our inventory, I bet you interesting stories are going to come, come out, out and interesting exactly things it. about the things we find. Um, that maybe that'll be a anyway, just trivial things that that bring a, a smile to your face and say, "Wow, that's I cool. particularly liked the e blast because it tracked the shy history all the way through. I saw, mm -hmm. yeah, you were that's famous cool. in several places on that, and I made sure to get famous in several places. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't exaggerating. <laughs> Well, there, I think there was one of Mary in there also. Mm -hmm. Yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. So we kind of a family yeah. there too. Well, anyway, that, as always, that's open. We can just leave it on here, but that's open if anybody wants to put anything together. And if you ever need access to scrapbooks, just let me know. They're here. So. Oh, speaking of the scrapbooks, that was a big hit. Oh yes, yeah, it was. having those out at the open yeah. house. Yeah. Betsy said it was a huge hit. Yeah, that's what she told me. Was wow. it? It was huge. Cool. Wow, people loved it. Nice. Yeah. I was, you know, when I heard it at first, I was like, oh no, you know, they're exactly. so delicate, but people right. were respectful of them. And we put, we didn't have like, we kept the first one, one yeah. 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 we yeah. kept the first one yeah. away from yeah. that, yeah. because there are things that actually are in there that belong in the museum archives. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. But that was uh, the other portion of, yeah. that I put out to the museum after the scrapbook digitization is of 
portions of those might live in the archives eventually. Mm -hmm. The first one being the very first, the very, the very first, first book wow. contains some content that I believe Eric Mason will be at. Yeah, that needs to be in the archives. Um, any other comments or subjects to bring up? We're early today. 1020. Okay, that should be adjourned. Can I have a motion? I make a motion that we adjourn. I second. All in favor? Aye. Aye. We are adjourned. <laughs>